Hey y'all, it's me, Nita. Welcome and welcome back. In today's video, y'all, we will be rearranging this furniture here in my living room as well as rearranging and refreshing some of the decor pieces. So if you are ready to see some goals and some neutrals styled in a very cozy and luxurious way, then this video is for you. Stick around. So I wanted to begin with moving this credenza and I did not realize how heavy it was with all of this stuff in the inside so I had to take out everything from the inside of the credenza before I can even push or pull it. Here you'll see me moving a lot of the items and furniture or pieces out of the room so that I can easily move the larger pieces around in the space. I want to stop in to say welcome and welcome back if you are new then welcome but of course if you've already been here you already know what to do welcome back and guys so i just want to take this moment to say thank you guys so much for always tuning in stopping by watching my videos and supporting the channel i want to thank you so much for hitting that like button and leaving your beautiful comments it really helps my channel out a lot so if you have not yet liked the video, please do so. If you haven't left a comment, please do so. And if you are watching but you have not yet subscribed, please do hit that subscribe button so that you can become a part of the family as well. And while you're at it, there's a notification bell that I would love for you to just tap it and you'll be reminded each time I upload a new video. Once again, to all of you, I want to say thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. And please stay until the end for the reveal. I can still remember the first time that we kissed. Feeling light as a feather. I always want to feel like this.
Y'all, I'm just standing here in the center of the room feeling so dumbfounded. I'm just trying to figure out my whole space and what items I want to use and is this the right setup. And so I, I'm a bit confused right now at this moment. But, you know, like I said, sometimes decorating is almost like a science. Okay, y'all, I guess I figured it out. And so I'm just going to give you guys an overview of the new furniture arrangement and the empty space of the room prior to me redecorating. So before I lay out the decor, I do just want to spruce up a few of the glass and mirror areas in the room the room is fairly clean and if you noticed in the overview I don't have a lot of pieces in my living room space it's not a really tight space I don't have a lot of pieces that are really close together or the tight fitting or congested and so the room it really stays um, clean and it doesn't collect a lot of dust not like it did a few years ago when I had so much stuff going on in my living room and as you can see here in that clip I'm just opening up the credenza letting you see how I put everything back inside and try to organize it as best as I can but yes you know the room is decorated and styled much different than it was say four or five years ago and so it stays a lot less dusty and I can appreciate that so I really like it but like I said just dusting the little areas here and cleaning some of the glass and the mirror areas before we start decorating decorating the left side of the credenza and I will start with this large glass light brown tinted vessel here that I picked up from home goods a while ago I've been had it for maybe about two years home goods always have these large glass vessels and they have them um, a lot of times in different colors as well and just recently I picked up this new addition to kind of go with the larger one I never saw the smaller one in brown there so I decided to um, let me go ahead and pick it up it'll um, pair really well with the larger one that I have and also I noticed that once I got it home the smaller one is in a darker tinted brown color the larger one is a lighter tinted brown but I think that still contrasts really well with each other so I think it's gonna work great and this one was $7.99 so this is a new addition and then I also have this new addition here I picked up the chiseled horse head this is in a bronzy gold finish this one was from home goods as well and this one was uh, 29 $39.99 I believe it was $39.99 okay and I am going to add this here and again if you kind of know how I decorate I do like to pair things in threes and this is going to complete this look right here okay so now we're going to move to the right side of the credenza and i'm going to be adding in this tray of assorted candles all white in different sizes and different shapes and so i just think this is a very classic look and i really like that look with the assorted candles um and just sitting on a large tray and to finish up the look on this side of the credenza, I'm going to add in this faux orchid plant, which helps to balance the space as well. And I also like the fact that the planter is in a light brown as well. So this is the look for that side. Now I'm going to style the coffee table, guys. I'm going to keep this um, really simple. I'm just going to add these three coffee table books and I already had these on the coffee table but I'm actually gonna keep these on the coffee table because I like them so much as well as this candle that I really like I love the fragrance I love the style and I love that it has this really rich dark brown on it so I'm keeping that there and I'm gonna add my candle 
accessories here. And then I'm just gonna top the table off with this large gold, bold, bold with the large beads inside. And I'm not gonna arrange them any kind of way. I'm just gonna throw them inside and let it be. So that is the look for the top of the coffee table, guys. And that completes that look. And over here on the side of the credenza, I'm gonna add my really two large gold lanterns. And these, I picked these up from Home Goods. This was last year, I believe it was around Christmas time. And so I'm gonna finish this corner off by adding in this large ginger jar. And over here on the poof, guys, I'm just gonna style this with a coffee table book. This is also a new edition that I picked up from Home Goods. It is titled The Beauty of Home. This is a very good book, guys. Lots of beautiful pictures that you can pull some inspiration from. And this book was $24.99. Normally, I do remove the, the paperback, but um, I'm gonna keep the paperback on since I'm gonna display the book open. And so, I'm gonna just sit it here on top of the poof. And I'm gonna add these wooden links here. And then, that completes this look. And so guys, I'm gonna let you guys know if you haven't already noticed by now, I love baskets. I love me some baskets. Baskets add so much texture and coziness to a room and I can't, I can't do without a basket. But this one is also a new um, piece here. And I picked this one up from Home Goods, and this one was $19.99. I thought this was a good price for this basket. It's a nice size, lots of texture. Again, ugh, the straw. Um, I thought that this was fabric, but it's actually not fabric. It's like a plastic. So it's very sturdy. I actually love this basket, and I'm gonna add this to the space of the living room, along with this throw and this beautifully textured pillow. I'm just gonna sit it right there in this space, right there. And this in here, like that. And this, can y'all see me? I got the camera a little far away. Okay. Let me make it fall a little more naturally. I'm not trying to make it look neat or anything. I just wanted to kind of look. horse head on that little console table back there but guys I know you have been seeing me use this horse head throughout my living room for the past couple of styles or designs that I've been doing in my living room and that's us I love this big old ugly horse head <laughs> I'm just kidding it's not ugly guys I love it it's such a design piece and it actually brings in a very you know unique piece to the space is full of texture is a conversation piece I actually really enjoy looking at this horse head and I said to myself that I was not gonna leave it in this space this time but I still want to look at it so I'm gonna keep it here for now stays here stays here y'all let me know if I should ditch the horse head if I or if I should keep it around a little longer because I'm enjoying that horse head. These pillows, guys, I picked up from Home Goods a while ago as well. Not a while ago, but a few months ago. And I love it. It has the gold specks in it, gold detail inside. The pillow is like an ivory color. And the back is uh, silky champagne.
And these pillows I have for a while too. I really like these pillows. I love the texture on the pillows. I love the design. It has little gold and silver um, threading or something in here, but I really like it. So I'm gonna add these pillows with those. And since the design on these pillows are almost like a print, um, I think it pairs really well with these pillows because the uh, design on these pillows are more textured. So it's not just a print, but it's act the actual threading and um, the stitching, which gives this pillow the texture. So I really like that look, and I like the combination. Okay guys, so lastly, I'm gonna go ahead and add this lamp. To this table as well as this bowl here and I'm gonna slide that right inside of the table the tour you'll see that my style is transitional and you'll know that by the mix of modern glam traditional and organic decor which I think I have blended so well together thank you guys enjoy Oh yeah, this could all be over We're not okay Shattered glass everywhere Tears of rage Waiting for the rain to stop And take my pain away Why'd you have to be that mean? Why'd you do me that way? We should know that we won't be any better Can't you see that we are drifting apart? I am through trying to hold us together I just want it to stop, want it to stop Ah uh -huh. smoke spirals off your cigarette Ah uh -huh. door slam to figure silhouettes Is this over? Is this over? Is this over? Can this be over now? Is this over? Is this over? Is this over? Can this be over now? Baby, I surrender. I can take it anymore. I don't want to remember. Just wanna let it all go. Waiting for a new day When I will feel no pain You will have to let me go So I can be myself again We should know that we won't be any better now. Can't you see that we are drifting apart I am through trying to hold us together I just want it to stop Want it to stop No Smoke spirals off your cigarette Ah ha Door slam to figure silhouette Come on, say Is this over? Thank you guys so much for watching I hope that you have enjoyed the video And until the next time Stay well Be blessed And I love you Bye bye